friends, today we're going to be talking about volume. At the end of this video, you should be able to define volume, identify the unit we use to measure volume, and calculate volume. Let's start with the definition for volume. Volume is a measure of a three-dimensional space occupied by an object. If it can be filled up, then it has volume. Let's play a game. Take a look at the picture shown. If it has volume, give me a thumbs up. And if it does not, a thumbs down. Does a triangle have volume? No, it does not, because it's a two-dimensional, hence cannot be filled up. Does a rectangular prism have volume? Yes, it does. A rectangular prism is a three-dimensional. Great job, guys. Now let's talk about the unit used to measure volume. Volume is measured in cubic units because it represents a three-dimensional space. To understand this, think of a cube. It has three dimensions, length, width, and height. The cubic part indicates that we're measuring a three-dimensional space. It's like filling up a cube with tiny cubes, each one representing a unit of volume. The total number of these tiny cubes gives us the volume of a larger cube. Take this rectangular prism, for example. To find the volume, you can fill it up with unit cubes. Then count how many unit cubes was used to fill it up. Three layers with four unit cubes in each layer. The volume is 12 cubic units. This is one way you can find volume. You can also find volume using a formula. Remember, when you talk about volume, you are talking about three dimensions, length, width, and height. You can multiply these three dimensions to find volume. Take a look at this rectangular prism. It has a length of 12 centimeters, a width of 4 centimeters, and a height of 8 centimeters. To find the volume, we are going to be talking about these three dimensions. 12 centimeters times 4 centimeters equals 48 centimeters. And 48 centimeters times 8 centimeters equals 384 cubic centimeters. Another way to find the volume is by multiplying the base by the height. The base is 48 square centimeters because 12 centimeters times 4 centimeters equals 48 square centimeters. Base times height is 48 times 8, which is 384 cubic centimeters. Let's revise what we have learned today. Volume is a measure of three dimensional space occupied by an object. If it can be filled up, then it has volume. Volume is measured in cubic units. Lastly, you can find volume by counting how many unit cubes is needed to completely fill the object. You can also find volume by multiplying length times width times height or base times height. Thanks for watching. See you next time.